Hi guys, welcome back to another iHorse Racing video. Um, it's been quite a while and I am super excited to announce something, something big, something that's um, going to be rewarding and uh, something I'm really excited about, which um, I, ca I came up with um, with the help of one friend, uh, which I will mention a bit later. So this is how it's going to happen. We, unfortunately in our horse racing, there's never ever been a feature added where I can have a massive tournament with players. And obviously I don't have the resources. Um, I, I do not own millions of diamonds and millions of coins. I'm just a normal player like you all. But I try to make the community as interesting as possible. Now, I've come up with a brilliant idea, which I would like to think is brilliant. Um, we would be having the ultimate club clash playoff. Now, this is how it's going to work. I have not confirmed with players yet, but let me first tell you that this will be really rewarding. This will be a lot of diamonds, a lot of coins to the respective clubs that win um, compared to a normal grade one season because obviously we, I want to make it worth, worthwhile playing. Um, this will also be the first ever iHorse Racing live event. The full session will be streamed online. Um, so also on Facebook, you'll be able to keep your club members up to date and all that. You'll understand more when I start explaining right about now. So this is how it's going to work. We will be making use of the club clash option, which no one uses in the game. But this is the best way to use it and to use it for a massive tournament. Now, there will be created, there will be two clubs created at first. Ultimate Club 1 and Ultimate Club 2. Then, in that position, the full 20 members will be invited for a club clash. That's one season of racing. Now, before I tell you how, let me first tell you how the uh, respective clubs have been picked for this massive prize of diamonds and, and coins. Um, I'm also not going to mention the prizes yet, as I've not got um, the exact amount yet from higher um, positions such as GM, but he did confirm that it'll be a worthy price of playing for. Now, this is how it's going to work. Ultimate Club 1 has been picked on the top world ranking clubs, but keep in mind that even Club 2 has all been picked on relevant, if your club is still relevant, I'm not picking... Even my old club, like winning form, I can't pick winning form because they haven't been racing. King's Landings, they're not racing. You, you need to be a relevant club. You need to be a club that's racing day to day. You need to be an active club. You need to have a club that has a lot of members. And there is a few clubs that, ha that have only a little bit of members. But I mean, I've tried to pick the most active clubs to reward them. And I think I did a really good job of picking fairly. And I had the help. So this is the most fair I could be. Um, Obviously, you won't have everyone happy, but that's unfortunately how racing works, and that's how the community works as well, so I can't have everyone happy. But let me introduce the first ultimate club, club number one. Um, everyone is in yellow. I'll be have to, um, how it's going to work is basically, I'll show you the club, the respective club leader of that club. For example, if it's Dragon Racing, the club leader of Dragon Racing is going to need to personal message me and say, right, for my positions, I would be, our players will be... Um, examples i'm just gonna you, you give me your names for your positions that cannot be changed throughout the competition that's a very important thing you need to know right here we go ultimate club one this is how it's going to look it's going to be dragon racing filling position one two three my reasoning behind the club i'm also going to give they're active they're the number one in the world currently and they are winning g1 championships it's a, quite a simple decision. MTC falls in position four with only one position for them. That means only one member. Now, the reason behind that is because they haven't been on the map for quite a while. They've reappeared. Unfortunately, I can't credit them with two or more spaces. They'll have one space, one member representing MTC. Then, free Casmir. They're racing quite often. They're active club. They're always thereabouts. They get free positions. They get their respected positions. Wings racing from position eight to position 10. They're racing every day, every season. They're having a go at them. They're very active. Jaguars is an upcoming club. They have uh, 20 members maxed out. They're racing more. Um, they had a good start to the season already on 70 grade ones. They get one position because they're not a big club yet. Last Ottomans, they, they were big in the past, but they're not racing much. They get one position. Saint Lodge will get two positions in Ultimate Club 1. 
Turkey Race Club will get one. The club will get free. There's obviously a big battle between Dragon Racing and the club. They also get free positions. Papa Mama Club is one of the outsiders, is one of the wild cards and ultimate clubs. One. Number 20 is myself. I won't be racing. I'm the mod, so I can view the races and stream the races, and I can be the leader, so no one gets the coins and the diamonds, obviously, only, lot, only later when it's distributed. This is a semi-playoff. This is not the final. Right. That's Ultimate Clubs 1. Also put a post on Facebook. Let me introduce club, ultimate club, club number two. This is how it's going to look. Sport of Kings will take the top three positions. Then um, Al Inan, I hope I'm saying that right, will take the other three positions. Phoenix Racing, they'll have from seven to nine. Club Brazil from t 10 to 12. These are all relevant clubs. They're all racing daily. Um, Dominicano is also up there with uh, 13th and 14th spots. Super, super stable. Their upcoming club, I've given them one spot. Um, six little uh, Ganyan, I hope I'm saying that correct, apologies if not, they get one spot, they are relevant, but they're not there yet with the members, TJK will get one spot, Rapid Authority, of, um, authority, authority will get one spot, and number 19, a club called Rocket, the reason I'm giving that to Rocket is because this is the respective um, uh, individual that gave me the idea for, uh, for for ultimate clubs or not exactly but i played around with it a bit and i've picked his his idea so he needs to have a chance of obviously getting the money as well and then obviously the 20th spot is tim mod now club one is a much harder club to qualify for so this is what i am gonna do right the top 10 in club one will qualify the top nine in club two will qualify that will create one big final pool, which is going to look as follows. Um, the, re the representative that qualify will fall into this bracket. This will be the finals. And um, the top three representative club representative will win their club rewards. The rest, it's all to play for, or you're walking home with nothing. And obviously, I'll be the moderator at all three groups. This is how it's going to work. It's going to be massive. If your club does not want to take part, you do not have to. I will, or I'll just remove you and insert a smaller club or a bigger club. Um, how it's going to work is I need your leader to uh, PM me if you decide to go for it. And you need to give me the representative that will represent your club in the ultimate clubs.